Hey yo, since you clicked on this video, you are officially a glizzy gobbler. To undo this, drop a like right now. If not, enjoy gobbling them glizzies. No cap. I keep that lid on me like I got a text. Five for cigarette, I need one when I'm straight. Looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more, visit sportstmb.com. He has been in the community for years and has hundreds of reviews. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Charles. Okay, I'm back to another video, man. If you're new to the channel, I'm new to subscribe. You turn subscribe, you to like. Comment down below what your boy now. He doing and turn on those posts in the case so you never miss an upload from me, your boy. Now, it is September 1st as of me uploading this, so y'all already know what that means. The giveaway winner will be on the screen right here. Now, if you have one to give away, what I need you to do is mention me on either Instagram or Twitter. Mention me on any of my socials that's in the description and get back to me within 24 hours. If you do not respond within 24 hours, I then will be forced to have to requeue and find somebody else to win the giveaway. But listen, listen, y'all. So since this is my last video on 2K20, let me say that again. This is my last video on 2K20. Here's what I'm going to do. If you do not win that giveaway, I'm going to do a giveaway part two. All y'all got to do is get this video to 500 plus likes and we on. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to do that one live, okay? 500 plus likes. Comment down below, rp 2 k 20 and yeah, man, and before I even get into this glitch, bro, I just want to say thank you to all you guys, bro, you know what I'm saying? Coming up, how I came up, off glitches, jump shot videos, helpful videos, you know, talking about stuff that happened in the community. You don't see that nowadays, you know what I'm saying? Most people are coming up just like everybody else. I chose a different route, you know what I'm saying? It's a few people doing what I'm doing, but you know what I'm saying? Me, I feel like I'm the hardest working. In my opinion, if you if you ask me, I just feel like I'm the hardest working when it comes to glitches, jump shot, helping y'all out. And you know what I'm saying? This year on 2K21, I'm going to do it all. I'm going to stream, glitches, jump shot, gameplay. I'm going to give y'all everything, you know what I'm saying? Just so I can really, really get to that grind and really achieve my goals. So yeah, without further ado, let's get into this video. Now, this glitch is going to be really, really simple to do. All you need is 2K20. Any console is going to be able to do this. Xbox One, so whatever, you know what I'm saying? Whatever you want, Stadia, anything, whatever you want is going to be able to do this. So to start this glitch, all you simply want to do is set up to my league. Go to manage files. Now, if you have too many, just like you see me, I got way too many. You want to delete one, all right? Because you want to start a new my league, all right? Now, once you guys have hit start new my league, all you simply want to do is go to current NBA teams, start in regular season, select start mode. Now, from here, you can choose any team. You know me, I just like doing the Lakers when we doing anything my league related. Now, uh, these settings right here really do not matter. You just hit start on those. And now, once this message pops up, all you simply want to do is select auto generate rookies. And then it will, you know what I'm saying, bring you to the calendar screen as you guys can see. And once you guys are at the screen, you just want to hit circle. And you guys want to keep clicking R1 to get into your settings. Now, once you guys are in your settings, head over to the My League settings. And you want to change your quarter length to 12 minutes. Just like I got mine. Leave the simulated quarter length on 12 minutes as well, okay? Then you want to head over to the settings tab. Now, from here, you're going to turn your game speed all the way up to 100 as you guys see me doing you're going to turn your fatigue off and you're going to turn fouling out off okay this is exactly how you want your settings to look game difficulty you can leave it on pro really does not that does not matter now once you have that you want to back out head over to your coach settings all right now basically you're going to turn everything that i'm turning from auto you're going to turn it to manual as you guys can see everything that says you know what i'm saying auto put it on manual all right now once you have your settings looking just like this just back out of this and one last thing we have to do before we get started is go to CPU and user sliders. Now from here, all you want to do is hit triangle and hit X, but you don't want to back out yet. You want to go all the way down to the file. Now, once you guys get to the files, you want to simply take everything down to zero as you guys see me doing right now. If you guys do not know how to, you know what I'm saying, quickly do this, simply hold the, the D-pad to the left and then hold the left stick to the left as well. And it will quickly uh, take down uh, anything, any setting or whenever you're doing something like this. So yeah, this is how you guys want your files to look exactly like mine. Now, once you have done all those settings, simply back out and you want to get back to the calendar screen. Now, once you guys are at the calendar screen, as you guys see, I'm here. All you want to do is simply hit X and play the game. All right. Now, if this message pops up, at least that do manually, as you guys just see me. And then you just want to go to have CPU adjust the rotations. Now, once you guys get to the screen asking what team you want to be on, you just want to put yourself in the middle and simply hit X to start the game. And that will begin to load up. And I'll be right back once it's done loading.
Okay, now once you guys get into this game, as you guys can see, you will be in like this little broadcast camera, like up in the Raptors. That's exactly what you guys want. So look, basically all you gotta do is let this play out, you know what I'm saying? Your team, win or lose, you get the same amount of VC. So you just wanna let this play out, you know what I'm saying? Go chill, watch you a movie, you know what I'm saying? Make you some food, chill with your girl, do whatever you do. Now look, I'm just about to go do that and I'm gonna let this fast forward until it is done. And I'll be back to show you guys the results from this glitch. Y'all know my fast forwards don't take no time. So yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, now as you guys can see, the game is officially over. And uh, once the game is over, all you simply want to do is head over to quit. It will then prompt you to this 2K20 screen, and then the screen will go black. And once the screen has went black, you just want to look in the bottom left-hand corner, as you guys can see. That's how much VC I got from doing this 1,000 VC. Now, y'all, the, the less time you do, the less VC you get. The more time you do, the more VC you get. So keep that in mind. Now, I just want to say thank everybody who supported me on my 2K20 grind. The 2K20 grind is officially over. And we are 87K strong at the end of 2K20. 2K19, I don't know how many subscribers I had. I think I had like 25K, 30K probably. And once 2K20 came out, I really put in that time. People, you know what I'm saying, they call my videos fake, all that bullshit, all that extra shit. But at the end of the day, nothing I post is fake. I would not sit here and do that to you guys. And if my stuff was so fake and all that and, and calling people call it trash and all that, it's funny how I'm still sitting here getting 10,000 views damn near on every glitch that I post. You know what I'm saying? Even throughout the year, even throughout August, I was still getting a certain amount of views on a glitch. And, but my stuff is so fake. My stuff is so trash. That's how I know the people that be in my comments, that be talking shit, they really are fans. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, I'm not bragging on none of my views or nothing that I'm getting. I'm blessed to be able to get that. And I put in work to be able to get that at the end of the day. And 2K21 is going to be a movie. So yeah, 500 likes if y'all want a part two of the giveaway for 2K21. Don't forget to like this video. Don't get to that giveaway. RIP 2K20. It's your boy Charles 2K. I'm out.